hello everyone welcome to the CFT and CAT tutorials today in this session we'll be learning about uh, rectangle commands in solid oak so you can find rectangle command over here and if you click in this drop down menu you will find five different options among which four are the uh, rectangle only and those are basically differentiate according to the uh, in points required or say you can say input points mm, and uh, fifth one is a parallelogram uh, actually parallelogram doesn't comes under the rectangle but uh, in solid rock it is included inside the rectangle so uh, we'll be learning about it in uh, rectangle only so first one we'll select corner rectangle corner act, uh, rectangle uh, means uh, it requires to have it requires to have points uh, of two opposite corners say I'll click here uh, my first corner is specified and as I am dragging the uh, size of the rectangle is also being increased and uh, wherever I click second time it will be my second opposite corner so this is my rectangle now if I want to change the length of the side I can change by using smart dimension here also so I'll click smart dimension I'll make it say 100 okay now the side is of 100 mm length but uh, you should note that you cannot change the angle of uh, rectangle because rectangle will have fixed angle that is 90 degree so now we'll see what is the second type and second type is uh, center rectangle so here we require a center point and one of the corner points say I have clicked uh, here so that it is my center my first point has become a center whereas my second point will be my uh, corner so see here uh, I can increase its size by dragging up so my second point is the corner and we'll see the third option over here so it is three three point corner rectangle so in first case in a corner rectangle we were giving just two points now we require to have three points of a corner it is not opposite corner so it is just adjacent corner so here I've clicked once which is a first corner for me and second and third you can see here is a uh, next rectangle and fourth one is three point center rectangle here we need to give center at first see it is a center uh, whatever my first point here it will be center second point is a midpoint between the uh, one of the side and third point will be the corner point so the final one is parallelogram in the parallelogram we need to specify the uh, three point of any adjacent corner so first point will be my first corner point second point and third point now uh, for this parallelogram I can adjust the angle see uh, okay it is 56.11 say I'll make it 30 yeah now it is 30 degree uh, and one thing again I must say to you uh, here is say uh, okay this is one rectangle uh, it is not having uh, a fixed angle to uh, say some reference axis x axis y axis so if I want to make it horizontal I can add relation to this say I want this side uh, I want this side to be horizontal so I'll make it horizontal so it is horizontal now so similarly you can make it vertical and you can fix that uh, position orientation of that rectangle uh, it can be done from here uh, hope uh, 
this session was very useful to you and please subscribe my channel for further videos and thank